collection of people that we knew. Uh, we didn't do a call because that would have just taken too much time and things like that. We put together a collection of people of, of uh, people that we knew who we thought might be interested in. Um, we got them on board. And then one of the things I think is really interesting for us in terms of the process was we had everyone um, submit Google Doc versions of their essays. And then we um, did a sort of peer review of each other's essays. So everybody was able to, and I had a space where they were all linked and stuff. And so everyone was, was I, I put people into groups like you would just like for a peer review for a class. Um, and then I also made it available so everybody could see everybody else's essays. And so what that did, it did, and, and the other thing is, is that um, we made it really clear from the beginning that this was, this wasn't a competition sort of issue, nor was it sort of an issue of, of review the way that academic publishing tends to work where people are, um, you know, used to getting comments like accept, rarely just accept, usually it's revise and resubmit or reject or whatever. We, as we said, everybody's like, you're in, we're going to publish this. What we're trying to do is we're trying to find ways to make these essays better and also to try to get interaction between uh, the writers. And so what happened then is that, you know, uh, you had uh, uh, contributors in this collection being able to comment on each other's work, and it really did make the collection a whole lot better than it could have been uh, when, we, when we first got it started. So for the purposes of the project, I think it was essentially a logistical solution to a time problem. Because if we had done a traditional sort of thing where it was just me and Charlie responding to all these essays, it would have taken like three times as long. And um, so that was sort of the initial thinking about it. That being said, I think that it makes imminent sense for these kinds of collections to have these kinds of interactions because... Um, when you have people, and I'm thinking in particular in terms of like collect collections of essays or maybe a journal with a theme to it or something like that, when you have, um, when you have the, uh, uh, a group of people who are all responding to each other, who are all in the same space, then you really can have literal conversations between um, the writers in that collection instead of this sort of like, you know, non-connection. I mean, I've, I've had any number of essays in collections where I got the book or the journal or whatever. And I'm like, Oh, I didn't know that so-and-so was being published in that. And so it, it's, it was, I think that that sort of connection up front makes uh, a lot of sense. And I know from everyone who I talked to um, who contributed was a part of it, that it was a really rewarding experience for them too. Um, and